Have you noticed that more doors are locked during the day this year than last year? Well, we investigated what students and the teacher at West think about this. Active shooter situation, is that different from a tornado drill or a fire drill? Quite a bit different. Um, the ALICE training that we've been trained in the last several years is, um, is quite a, it's very much more intense. The Iowa City Police Department, the Corvo Police Department are involved. It is done outside of the school day. Uh, it will involve uh, different scenarios where the teachers and the professionals from the Iowa City and Corvo Police Department will lay out specific situations and then we are brought into our classrooms and then there is a simulation of uh, what may happen in a uh, active shooting situation. And then the teachers, we have to respond to what we may have to decide on any given situation as uh, where we would be, what our students would be having to think about, and then we have to make uh, life. Do you think students should have to do active shooter drills like they do for fires and tornadoes? I think so, yes. Um, I think that I've heard the teachers have done kind of a drill, like a, uh, I'm not sure what it's called, but they've done a drill, and I think if the students were to experience that, it would kind of help them um, and just be more ready for something to happen. I think this year with the uh, reduced number of doors that are are available for people coming in is a plus. However, uh, as the technology is uh, going to be developing in our building for cameras and for more security in the near future, then that is where we're going to be. It's just a matter of the construction isn't completed for that yet. Do you think students should do active shooter drills like we do for fires and tornadoes? Yes, because so kids will know what to do if an event happens. Okay. Some doors are locked during the day now. Do you think that we should introduce, we should have all doors be locked? I think that's not realistic. Um, you know, first off, those are locked from the outside um, coming, you know, so obviously everyone can leave at any time, which would be necessary. Um, no, because students will come and go, parents will come to go, uh, members of our community come and go. Uh, I think this year with the uh, reduced number of doors that are, are available for people coming in is a plus. However, uh, as the technology is uh, going to be developing in our building for cameras and for more security in the near future, then that is where we're going to be. It's just a matter of the construction isn't completed for that yet.